Good morning, Grant Middle School. Today is Thursday, January 4th. It is a 2.30 dismissal. I'm your host, Carter Markham, and this is my co-host, Craig Wubin. Today is an even day. What's on the menu today? Big Daddy's Pizza or hot ham and cheese on a bun. Please clean up after yourself after lunch and breakfast. Treat yourself, others, and the building with respect. Also, remember, no food is allowed in classrooms. Please be respectful to our learning environment. This includes in your computer bags. Chromebooks are being damaged by the items students are shoving into their bags. So your bag should only include your Chromebook, its charger, unless you leave it at home to charge as expected your cell phone, and earbuds. Your Chromebook should not include, among other items you decide to put in there, food of any kind, candy or gum, drinks or any other liquid, perfume, body spray, deodorant, lip gloss, pens and pencils, papers, purple positives, your gym clothes, door, uh, dirty or clean. This expectation is necessary in order to keep your Chromebooks in working condition. Students, you need a green or laminate nurse pass in order to see the nurse. You cannot just go on your own. Now to Aylin with sports. Thank you, hosts. Seven and eighth grade boys basketball play at Mount Zion Friday at 4.30. They will have a home game mon on Monday, the 8th versus Lincoln slash Wall Charter. Now back to our hosts. Thank you, Aylin. Rose is here with activities. Thank you. Rehearsals for the GMS Spring Play, Peter Pan, will be begin on Wednesday, January 10th from 1.45 to 4 p.m. in the art room. We will conduct a read-through of the play during our January 10th rehearsal. Scripts will be handed out at that time. Cast and crew members may turn in their signed per permissions forms to the guidance office by January 10th. Extra per permission forms may be picked up at the guidance office. Scholastic Bowl practice for this week has been canceled. Please remember to get your fees paid and paperwork turned into Ms. Romer. Meta Club will meet Thursday, January 11th after school. Now back to our host for the rest of the announcements. Thank you, Rose. Get out there and get involved. Make sure you are ready for the metal detectors when you get to school. Look through this list. It will help you prepare. Administrative lunch attention lists are posted in three spots around the school. On the bulletin board outside of room 112, outside of room 227, in between rooms 215 and 217. You, the student, need to check that list. Detention names are no longer read before lunch shifts. Additionally, after school detentions have started. There are Tuesdays and Thursdays after school from 2.30 to 4. Please note, if you are sent out by substitute, it will automatically be two after school detentions. If you are removed from lunch detention, it will result in an automatic lunch detention. Just like lunch detentions, these will be listed on the information boards around the building. The Purple Positive store will be open every Friday during all three lunch shifts. Check out the list. Eighth grade students, please listen. Wednesday, January 10th, 2024 at 6 is the preview night for eighth grade students who will attend Springfield High School or Southeast next school year to learn about classes and tour the building. You are welcome to go to the school and learn more about what to expect next year. Eighth graders who are attending Lanfear will have their open house on, at a later date. Remember, Learning Lab is offered Monday, Tuesday, and Thursday from 2.45 to 4. It will start again Monday the 8th. Find the link on one of your teacher's Canvas pages. Be sure to fill it out before the last lunch shift. Meet in the all-purpose room if you do stay. Remember, tardies are being counted during advisory every day. This means be in your class before the bell rings at 8 a.m. Mr. Crumb made the tardy policy clear, so do not act surprised if you receive consequences for coming late to school. You may have noticed that the building is in the process of being painted. This means that some classes will be in different rooms while the painting is completed. Mr. Taylor's AP will be in the gym today. His sixth period will be in the library today. Tomorrow, the the fifth, Miss Reynolds AP will be in the gym. And the rest of Miss Reynolds classes will be in the library on Friday. Remember to be respectful of others' property to and from school. The expectation of Grant is to keep your hands and feet to yourself at all times during the school day and on your way to and home from school.
For your safety, students should only cross at the designated crosswalk areas. Chatham Road, stand with Mr. Williams and Amos. Now please rise for the Pledge of Allegiance, led by Ms. Strauss Advisory Class. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. This jokes come from Reese W. What type of tea is the hardest to swallow? What okay. kind? Reality. Happy New Year, y'all. If you have a joke you want to share, email it to Mrs. Buckles or write it down on a piece of paper and place it in the box outside of room 203. Our idiom today is firing on the cylinders. If you're firing on the cylinders, you're functioning as well as you properly, possibly can. Kathy has been training hard so she, could, so she should be firing on all cylinders in the Olympic Games. Our vocabulary word is dense. Dense means closely compacted together, crowded or compact. It is easy to get lost in a dense forest thick with trees. Do we have any birthdays? Yes, Dariana Gordon and... El we also want to recognize the rest of the birthdays that happened over break. June 25th, Camilla B, Kamaya B, and Zelda C, all in sixth, have their birthdays. On June 27th, DeAnthony James in 6th and Matthew T in 7th celebrate. Mason Shore in 8th and Reese W in 6th have their birthdays on June 28th. Levi Johnson in 7th and Cartier Wallace have their birthdays on June 29th. On June 30th, Kaylee Melvin in 8th has her birthday. Okay. On July 1st has several birthdays. Jaylee Cody and Tyron Davis in 8th. Kyrie Davis and Kalea Haley, both in sixth. Happy, Happy birthday! birthday! Remember to take your Chromebook home and get it charged. Welcome back. Make it a great second semester.